Okay, we're going to do a baluster problem, and the baluster problem is um, uh, we've got a 98 inch distance including the two posts at each end, which are five inches a piece, and we're going to be installing uh, one and three quarter inch balusters with a four inch space. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm just going to draw a quick little drawing to remind myself of the problem that I'm doing. Here's the balusters, my, uh, or posts rather. My balusters are going to go in here and it says that outside to outside, including the posts, I have 98 inches. So that means these are five inches. This guy is five inches. And the distance I'm looking for to start my problem is in between. Okay? So step one says, what's the distance between the posts? 98 minus five minus five equals 98 minus 10 inches, which is equal to 88 inches. Okay, that's my clear dimension. The second thing I need to look up is my unit. Okay, my unit is equal to my space plus the width of the balusters. One and three quarters is 1.75 inches. So my unit is 5.75 inches. Now I'm going to adjust this dimension by adding that ghost baluster at the end to make my math work out so I have whole units. Okay, so I take my space between uh, overall of 88 inches that I found and I divide that uh, excuse me, I add my ghost baluster distance of 1.75 so that I can divide a whole into whole units, meaning that my adjusted length is equal to 89.75 inches. Now I take that adjusted length and I divide my units into my adjusted length, 89.75 inches divided by 5.75 inches equals, okay? The answer here is 15.6087 units. Now I don't want to build an odd partial number of units. I want to build hold units. So step five says round up, say 16 units. Okay. And then I'm going to go and I'm going to redivide. So I'm going to take that 89 0.75 inches, and this time I divide it by the number of units I know I'm actually going to build, 16 units, and it'll tell me how big the space is actually going to be, including the baluster. In this case, 5.6094 inches per unit. Now I simply need to subtract out the baluster width and find the space. So I take that 5.604 inches minus, excuse me, minus 1.75 inches equals a 3.8594 inch space, which is equal to about three and seven eighths inch space. So our target that we started with was four inches. We did this math to find out that won't work. We'll end up with too big a gap and we're gonna go with 3.7, three and seven eighths inches as a, as a space. And then the final step is just to remember to subtract that ghost baluster
that we added in. So we take our 16 units, minus one for the ghost, means we have 15 to install. And that is your baluster problem math.